Welcome ninth graders to Homestead High School, where your future awaits. Lucky for you, this is not uncharted territory. Here's a few tips on what to expect. Your brain is going through some drastic changes. Be prepared to feel a little forgetful as you prune old connections and make newer, faster ones. Your ninth grade year is full of new experiences, from new friends to new teachers to new clubs to try. Embrace these new opportunities and you will do great. New challenges are headed your way. Moliere once said, the greater the obstacle, the more glory in overcoming it. Look at challenges as an opportunity for growth. High school is a time for big changes in relationships. The important thing is to find your people. Maintain good relationships with your teachers and surround yourself with people that inspire and uplift you. View high school as a fresh start. It's a new building with new people and lots of opportunities for good first impressions. As you prepare to start your ninth grade year, remember your ninth grade year is the time where you set a strong foundation. As you work on setting a strong foundation, please know that we have safety nets and supports to help you. We can level classes from honors or AP to regular, and we can add seminar even after the semester starts. We also have tutoring options such as peer tutoring, National Honor Society tutoring, and the math resource room. Be sure to advocate when you need help by reaching out to teachers and your guidance counselor. We're happy to help. A typical school day involves seven classes a day except for Thursday due to advisory. We have six minute passing periods with a two minute warning bell. Be sure to be on time and be prepared for class upon your arrival. School starts promptly at 7.45 a.m. and ends at 2.35. Your lunch occurs during fifth period and is determined by your fifth period teacher. A rule of thumb is find a friendly face in your fifth period and you will have a nice person to sit with. Thursdays are advisory day. Advisory is a period of the week where you explore college and career possibilities through exploration and conversation with your advisor. The guidance counselors will also be in to visit your advisory. You will be tracking participation in extracurricular activities for your diploma, so remember to get involved and try something new. On the first day of school, you will start your day in your advisory classroom, so be prepared to go to your advisory classroom first thing. You will need a book bag, laptop, pens, pencils, notebooks, and something to organize your materials. This can include folders, trapper keepers, binders, whatever works best for you. Lunch is 25 minutes long. Remember to find a friendly face if you need somebody to sit with. We do have 10 lunch lines. My rule of thumb is choose the shortest line if you're not sure which line to choose. You'll need your student ID number to purchase food, and today you're going to practice going through the lunch lines. First impressions are key. When you are walking down the hallways, be sure to keep to the right and let faster traffic pass you on the left, much like if you were driving a car. Keep your head up, smile, and don't be afraid to say hello or how are you doing to staff and other students. Remember, you are new to the building, so these first impressions are so important. Be prepared on the first day, especially in English, with your summer reading assignment. It is okay to be nervous. Most of you will be. Remember to keep your head up and know that everything is going to be okay. As we start the school year, be on the lookout for additional information through your email. This will include information about the PE2 waiver, the personal finance test out option, and I also want to make sure that you're aware of our phone and headphone policy. Phones and headphones need to be put away during the school day. If we see them, we can take them and turn them into the office. Thank you for your time, and I hope you enjoyed this presentation. Best of luck, Spartans. Remember, you've got this.